carving has long been considered as one of Iranian arts and handicrafts. A person who cuts designs on a piece of wood and uses simple tools to carve them is called a woodcarver. Such a person is an extremely talented and gifted artist. He is not only bestowed with a creative mind, but is also uniquely talented in painting and drawing. He's able to carve whatever that comes to his mind. Wood is considered as the most important tool in this profession. The sculptor must choose a wood that besides having strength must be easy to smoothen and cut. To meet that purpose, the wood of walnut and pear trees are known to be the best to work with. Another important tool is also a chisel. Metal chisels that come in various sizes and for different functions. The carver uses mallets to create his intended design. Therefore, he uses chisels and mallets to cut details of his design in the best way possible. The talented craftsman carefully and patiently uses short and soft mallet strikes to carve delicate and beautiful designs. It's not very clear when wood carving was introduced in Iran. But with the expansion of masks in Safavid era, the craft of wood carving found a high status among Iranian architectures. It was widely used in making doors and windows and pulpits, membar, and Quran stands, rah. Fortunately, nowadays wood carving is not only an art but a widespread and expensive industry. Many artists have set up workshops to make wooden ornaments. It is said, Iranians are gifted with artistic talents and no one else.